death is definitely a blow for the fashion industry. Fashionistas, loved ones and some friends have been paying tribute and sharing fond memories of Kofi Ansa. Speaking with showbiz, a public relations personnel who also doubles as a fashion designer, Makiba Bwatin, shared some fond memories of him. I met him in 2000 when I first landed in Ghana. I was meant to work with Kofi Ansa. So we, we used to have lots of um, um, talks together where we speak about fashion and clothing and where I wanted to fit. But the last time I worked close with him was with actress Juliet Ibrahim. And first of all, you know, Kofi Ansa's collections they're always on bone skinny models he does not do past a certain size <laughs> at all you know so this was a very big favor you know and um, so we went to we took Juliet down there for the day and um, we spent hours with Kofi Ansan we laughed we joked I mean oh, it was a wonderful wonderful day we we got Juliet into you know this coat of his this is one of his signature lines and um, it's so heavy you know it's mud cloth it's beautiful workmanship and then he taught us how to do his signature head scarf chief executive officer of alan david collections alan david also shared with us what he will remember the late kofi and for. i remember i traveled together with mr kofi to kenya we have a show in uh, kenya nairobi the way the people have praising us in present Ghana fashion industry you know even Mr. Kofi is one of the design who lectured the master class designers you know on that day and uh, they are very inspired with what we are doing. Kofi Ansa, who was one of Ghana's few designers to have gained international recognition died the early hours of Saturday at the Kolebu Teaching Hospital. May his soul rest in peace.